This is Module 1, Lesson 13. Today's objective was to interpret the quotient as the number of groups or the number of objects in each group using units of three. Number three, Juan buys 18 meters of wire. He cuts the wire into pieces that are each three meters long. How many pieces of wire does he cut? Well, I know he has a total of 18 meters. So that's gonna be my first number in this division problem. Each is three meters long. That word each tells me that three is going to be my size. To help me solve this problem, I'm going to draw a number bond. I have 18 meters of wire. I'm going to count by threes until I draw eight to 18 so I know how many groups I have. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18. I have a total of six groups. So I need to write my sentence. He cut six pieces of wire. It's important in every problem that you are drawing a picture, writing a number sentence, and writing a sentence in words to answer the question. Number four, a teacher has 24 pencils. They are divided equally among three students. How many pencils does each student get? So this time we have 24 pencils. The teacher is dividing them among three students. We want to know how many pencils each student is going to get. Because I'm sharing them equally with three students, I'm going to draw an array to show how many pencils each student will get. Here's the first student, second student, third student. I'm going to keep counting and labeling until I get to 24. So there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I can see that in each row, there are eight dots. So that tells me that each student is going to get eight pencils. Each student gets three pencils. Solve number five on your own. You may draw a tape diagram, a number bond, or an array to help you solve the problem. Be sure to write a number sentence and answer the question in a complete sentence with words.